People who menstruate are saying it's hard to find tampons on store shelves across the U.S. right now, as supply chain upsets reach the feminine care aisle. I just went to five different Walgreens, and, the shelves are cleared, said one Twitter user this past week, while people on Reddit have posted. The shortage stems from a combination of factory staffing challenges, transportation bottlenecks, and the rising cost of key raw materials used to make the products, tampon makers say. CVS, Target and Walgreens said in statements to NPR that they were aware of a limited tampon supply at some stores. A spokesperson for CVS said that, in recent weeks, suppliers haven't been able to fulfill the full orders placed by the company. Both companies said they're working with tampon makers to replenish store inventory as soon as possible. Walgreens said its shortages may only be in specific brands while we navigate the supply disruption, but that its website is updated with the latest store-level inventory. Dana Marlowe, the founder of I Support the Girls, an organization that provides menstrual products for people with economic hardship, says the shortage has been happening for longer than most people realize. Marlowe says her group has seen a large drop in tampon donations in recent months. The organization received half as many tampons this year compared to the same time last year and over 60% less than in 2020. Our shelves are bare. Marlowe told NPR. Procter & Gamble, makers of Tampax products, told NPR the supply problem is temporary and that the Tampax team is producing tampons 24-7 to meet the increased demand. PMG, which owns the biggest market share of menstrual products, said in an April earnings call that sourcing and transporting raw M. Time first reported on the tampon shortage last week, noting that it's lasted longer than other shortages, like toilet paper and cleaning supplies, early on in the pandemic.